Good morning, everybody, and this is your Forex day trade setups for today. So, as usual, starting off with Euro USD, and uh, we are onwards and upwards at the moment, so uh, weakening dollar, which uh, is all based on the noise that came out last week. Uh, we did come back to test some structure here at 104.305, and if we just start drilling down to the hour, which is what we want to be paying attention to, you can see pretty big move down based on data and then an immediate recovery so um, it's always uh, a good good thing to do when you've got uh, when you're above the moving averages uh, trade with that trend until you're below and you get a crossover so that's pretty much what happened here down onto structure buy a step right in there and drove it higher so we do have another bit of structure and it's pretty clear what we need to pay attention to and that is 105443. Don't know whether that's going to materialize today, but that is the structure. We're up 380 points at the moment. So that's the area we want to be buying off. Uh, and this would be a 15 minute setup, uh, pretty much the same as what it was here off the structure. See inside bar, off the 15 minutes, and there's your second signal there. But you could have taken that first one there with a stop there. Um, or alternatively, you could have taken that one with a stop there. So uh, you're looking for the same kind of setup, looking for 105443. Pull back onto that, uh, gets you an opportunity to buy. Uh, US dollar Japanese yen reverses true. We obviously rejected this area here. Um, we've missed this big area that I was hoping for, which is 137.661. Uh, but you are still looking to trade with the trend. This is a little bit different to what happened on Euro USD. You can see a big move up, sellers came in, but we haven't quite created a new low. So I would be watching 135036. You're looking for a short there, um, off price action, uh, or alternatively, you know, if it does set up and you're looking for, that's a thousand point stop loss, but rich for my, my liking. So uh, what we're looking for is a rejection here on the 15 minute for a continuation down. And uh, what you're actually looking for here is the next level. It's going to be right over there. So your target is going to be 132596 on this one. Um, if we just get back to the Euro USD, I don't think we've got a target here. Okay, there's your target there. So your target here is going to be 106290. Uh, moving on to the pound, British pound, Japanese yen, still very much sideways, pretty much doing nothing. Got a bit of a crossover here, so uh, we could argue that it is looking to extend to the downside, but you can see fr Friday was big down, big up. Um, and now we're sort of in between these two levels. And uh, the one to the upside is 166034. And the one to the downside is 165139. Uh, a difficult one to, to ascertain, but I would be watching the high of Friday uh, because that could very well be another rejection coming off that area. But. Um, 15 minutes is probably the, the clever choice here. You're looking for structure on the 15 minute. So that's kind of the zone that you're looking at at the moment. So 165849 um, or a little bit higher at 166034. If you do get a rejection off there, there is potential for a move to close a gap at least. So that's to visit 165139. But other than that, I think it's probably safer just to wait for better structure here. Uh, moving on to Euro British Pound. We did get the rejection, but we didn't get follow through. The rejection we were looking for was off 086072. And if you get down to the hour, you can see we got it early in the session. Um, London breakout would have probably worked out. So that's uh, 246. There's your first eight one hour bars is there here it is there this uh, big red bar here is your eighth bar and actually it extends lower down 
there you go and you can see right onto the range target before bouncing off so uh, I'd be looking for the same kind of setup I think uh, you do have a little bit of structure to left so there is a level there it was rejected yesterday and there is another one right here uh, which is what we are busy rejecting at the moment so pay attention to 085773 and then also pay attention to this level here which is 085870 um, looking for a rejection there for a continuation to the downside and the target here is well the target's going to be pretty intense because we're going to be looking for a move down to uh, 085120 so uh, just pay attention to that because this is structure that you see here it looks like we are trying to break through this level and this level here is very very strong and that's at 085773 um, anyway that's it for me on forex I hope it helps and uh, we'll catch up with you uh, tomorrow morning cheers for now